In this video, we'll explain what condensation is, what causes it, and ways to help minimize it in your home. Condensation appears when warm, moist air comes into contact with cooler surfaces, like your window glass on a cold winter day. That's true with even the best performing windows. Although condensation is most common during the winter, it can occur whenever water vapor in warm air contacts a colder surface. That's why your iced tea glass sweats during the summer. The glass is cold and condensation forms when warmer, moist air comes into contact with it. Everyday living generates a surprising amount of indoor moisture. Cooking three meals a day adds four or five pints of water into the air. Each shower is another half pint. Every activity that uses water adds moisture. Regardless of its cause, the moisture source doesn't have to be where the condensation occurs. Vapor pressure can actually force moisture through plaster, wood, brick, and cement. Condensation doesn't mean there's a problem with your windows. In fact, the presence of condensation can actually be a sign that your windows have good, tight seals. Everything that makes homes more energy efficient, windows and patio doors that reduce air leakage, weather stripping, modern insulation, vapor barriers, and new construction techniques, also locks moisture inside your house and increases the chances of condensation forming. Condensation on the outside of a window is the same as dew on your lawn. It occurs mostly during the spring and fall when there are cooler nights and warmer days and is usually a good indicator of energy efficient windows. To help reduce humidity in your home, vent all gas appliances, clothes dryers, and exhaust fans to the outside. Ventilate your attic and crawl space. Cover the earth in the crawl space with a good vapor barrier. Run an exhaust fan in the kitchen when you cook. When you bathe or shower, run an exhaust fan until the mirror is clear. Avoid storing firewood in your home. If you have a forced air furnace, Make sure your home is properly ventilated. Contact your heating and air conditioning specialist for guidance. If you have any problems or situations not covered in this video, we'd like to help. Please call our customer care center. Anderson, customer care is what we care about most.